everyone for so more of Super Mario Brothers 1 hype for in my Around the Mario Maker World series here for Super Mario Maker 2. And like I just said, we are going to be playing Super Mario Brothers 1 levels, uh, well, part of my little mini series that I'm doing here in this main, this uh, playlist on Super Mario Maker 2. But, um, but yeah, I'm going to play half of this episode as Toadette, and I'm going to play the other half as Toad. I'm aiming for about a 30 minute long video if I can, so hope you guys are looking forward to that. By the way, hope you guys have an awesome day so far. And we're going to start things off here with this Japanese level. It's uh, called Minigame Mix. It's a standard single player stage, and it's aim times two, fast times two, fine times two, and then speed run. Enjoy. There's the course ID in case you guys want to try this. But yeah, I'll be playing the first 15 minutes as Toad, and I'll play, be playing the last 15 as Toad. Yeah, hope you guys have an awesome Friday, TGIF. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Oh, nice! Th didn't go as smooth as it should have, but I'm not gonna complain about that. Now we got fast. We got two of these we gotta get through. Okay, that one was easy enough. Hey there, Casey! Oh, I pounced off of that. Okay, now we got find. I guess that means find the difference. Okay, this one has a coin in it, so we're gonna go up this one. Okay, this one ha this last one has one less coin. And then now we're gonna end things off with a speed run here. Oh, jumped a little bit too soon there. Okay, GG. Yeah, if I didn't jump early there at the beginning of that speed run, I could, I could have, and probably should have one shot this, but I, I, this was a very good level to start things off on. I'm certainly not going to complain at all. I'm going to go ahead and give that one a heart. But anyway, let's try this Japanese level, and it's, uh, whatever in Japanese, parentheses, Super Mario Brothers version. It's a puzzle-solving single-player stage. And it's uh, to solve a mystery, then boss, then auto. There's the course ID in case you guys want to try this out. And also, I hope you guys are still enjoying my new Super Mario Brothers series that I'm doing. Which, of course, which it, it's a DS game, but at the same time, it's also... I'm playing it on the Wii U that way because I don't have any way to capture any DS footage, unfortunately. Okay, there we go. Nice. Nice. Oops. Hmm. 
<clears throat> Easy enough. Very interesting stage so far. Oh, okay. Shooting the wrong way, buddy. There we go. Nice. Okay, we got a snake block. Oh. Okay, just gotta do that. Oh, I see. There we go. Nice, thank you. I'm sorry I'm not saying a whole lot, I'm just trying to- This is a really involved level. Okay, we got a boss right here. Oh, shoot. I win. Okay. An auto part? Okay. Oh, that is cool. And you're welcome, by the way. A an awesome, awesome stage. I'm playing some good stages so far. Gonna give that one a heart? Let's try this one by Alien from Germany, and this is Mini Pixel Art Mix. It's an art single player stage, and it's I tried my best and made a tiny pixel art level. More in the comments. Okay, let's see what we have here. Enjoy. I think this will be the last level I play with Toadette, and I'm gonna switch to Toad. Okay, you see pixel art of Mario there? It's Mario in different games. Of course, that was Mario Brothers 3. There's Super Mario World. I think the first, well, the first one I believe was Super Mario Brothers. It's pixel art of the Super Mushroom.
And there's a star. There's Yoshi's egg. That's Mario's death animation in Mario Brothers 3. Bullet Bill? Well, technically Missile Bill because it's red. Goomba? Very nice! That's a nice stage! I like that! <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and give that one a heart. Go in here. And I'm gonna switch to Toad. Toad, uh, toad hype as always. So I have that voice crack there. Let's try this one by TP TP slash R from Japan. And this is Fast Mini Games. It's a themed single player stage and it's your reflexes will be tested. Enjoy. There's the course ID in case you guys want to play this. The clear rate's kind of high so that gives me a little bit of hope going into this. Nice. Okay. So far, so good. I'm so glad for that checkpoint. We're already at the last thing already. Oh, okay. That wasn't too bad. Oh, I was kind of hoping this stage would have been a, a bit longer. I enjoyed that. Nice. Yeah, I was kind of hoping that level would have been a little bit longer. I was enjoying that. I always do like those kind of levels. Yeah, I may lose a couple lives on them, but I enjoy them. Okay, let's try this one by J-Man S from the U.S. A very, uh, oh, a somewhat familiar maker. I know i played a few of his levels in the past. And this is Platforming with Munchers. It's a technical single-player stage. And it's Platforming with Munchers equals a fun adventure. Don't get munched. Good luck, have fun. World record is 28 seconds. Clue rate is under 10%. Just kind of hoping for a power up, but I guess I would defeat the purpose in a platforming stage. could have one shot this I absolutely I absolutely bottled that jump I could have easily one shot this I'll be very mad if I don't I mean it's too late I, I mean I'm not gonna one shot this but I'm very disappointed that I died there of all the places for me to die for me to die right there I'm very disappointed Yeah, that's not even all that hard of a jump. See, see, look at that. There should have been no reason whatsoever I shouldn't have one-shot this level. I'm very disappointed in myself. But anyway, very, very nice stage. I enjoyed that one.
Oh, I can't believe I didn't one shot that. Let's try another platforming level. This is by Two You from Japan, and now we're gonna be doing some Piranha Plant platforming. It's a technical single play single player stage. Unfortunately, I I don't speak or read Japanese, so I don't know what the description says. Clear rate's a bit higher, so watch. Uh, clear rate will be higher, but I'll struggle more with this one. What you watch? I almost forgot that I have the ducking ability here. Okay, checkpoint. I'm hoping I can one-shot this. Which I'm not gonna be able to. And of course I would have paid attention to the arrow. The arrow would have told me that I was supposed to duck. Which lucky I was able to do that anyway, but... Okay, checkpoint. Why am I screw- Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Why am I screwing that up? Come on, Teddy, you're not playing Super Mario Bros. You're not playing new Super Mario Brothers. There's no reason for you to be this bad. Come on. This is not- this is not- And I screwed that up again! You guys are probably wondering, is this guy for real? How am I screwing this up? Very simple jump. And I can't get it. There we go. That's all I had to do. No! Of course, freaking note blocks are what do me in. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I had no chance in hell of no sorting this. Come on. There we go. Level was made with endless uh, challenge in mind. Pathetic jump there at the flag. <laughs> I cannot believe it took me as long as it did to clear the stage. Wow, that was bad. Okay. Let's try this Japanese level. It's a music single player stage. I really don't even know what to expect here because I, I can't read Japanese. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, it's an upside down. Yeah, I can't lie. First part of that song, I thought for a minute that I was listening to Round 3 music from Monster Party for the NES. That's why I got kind of slightly excited about that. I'm like, oh, Monster Party music, but nope. 
let's try this one by Math. Well, it would be Matisse from France. And this is longest block. It's an earth stage, and it's you should follow this very long block. Difficulty three out of five stars. Okay, go. Whoa. So there's a, there's a different kind of snake block right here. I like this. Oh, pfft. And I just let myself get hit by a Goomba. That's nice. That's cool. Could have been a fire flower had I kept my mushroom. This is very interesting. I'm liking this so far. Oh, come on! Yeah, if I would have kept my fire flower, I would have got that coin. Of course, I can't because I'm a dope. But very cool stage. I like that. Let's try this one. Uh, this is a Japanese level, and this is Eruption of Flame. It's a standard theme stage. Unfortunately, I can't read this description. Okay. Yeah, I'm not starting off like that. Forget that. I wish there was a way you could change the color of the Goombas, especially like in the original Mario Brothers, Super Mario Brothers. They, the color of the Goombas and the castle were gray. I think it would be pretty cool if you could match the color, but unfortunately you can't do that. Hey there, Claire. Just playing some Mario Maker 2. Oh! That is almost very badly timed. Okay, checkpoint hype. <clears throat> Trying to be as careful as I can. Ok, 
Okay, nice. That level wasn't too bad. Okay, I'm gonna give this one a heart. And I have time to play one more level. Now, I was gonna play this Climb the Perplexing Pyramid level, but even though it doesn't show a, a, uh, a clear flag in our heart, I'm pretty sure I played this stage before, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip it. But I'm also gonna be uh, finishing, us off, uh, finishing this video off with this level from Cloud Crazy from Peru. I don't even remember the last time or even if I've ever played a level from Peru, so... I figured I'd end things off here, and this says thanks for the 20k loves. This is speedrun single player stage, and it's Sigun May and Twitch Como Cloud Crazy. Something about uh, finding him on Twitch, and that's his username on there. Boy, my Spanish is rusty. Yeah, this will be the last level I play on this video. Good start. I'm not gonna boo that, though. I probably should, but I won't. Okay, celebrating 20k. There we go! <coughs> Excuse me. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead... I'll give it a heart, even though I usually boo it, especially with the way that level started, but... Anyway, I will end things there. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I like doing these Super Mario Bros. 1 and Super Mario Bros. 3 hype videos, I think. They're a nice addition to my Mario Maker series as a whole, and especially the Round of Mario Maker World uh, playlist that I have going on here. And um, if you guys happen to try any of these levels, feel free to leave in a uh, comment below what you thought about them. But, uh, but um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying this series so far, and I'll be seeing you guys again next time.